hey, this is obviously a S M R, and I hope you're doing really well. Um, right now, I'm outside, as you can see, a rare occasion. Um, and yeah, I figured I would do a little ASMR video for you guys. Um, I'm at my mom's place right now, and um, I don't have my microphone on me, so this is why I figured if I'm recording a little by video anyway, might as well do it in a nice outside where it would be harder normally to record with a microphone. The sounds of the cars aren't too uh, too loud in contrast. There's some moss. And I think you can see the moss here. I positioned you on a birdhouse. I love moss. So, I've been gone for a little bit, that was because I was working on my master's thesis very intensively, but now I have turned it in, I uh, still need to go through like the rebuttal process and stuff like that. Graduation isn't until like October, but I am finally a free man. So I hope you can kind of relate to that since, you know, this is that time of year where the school year comes to an end. So for all the students or the high school students or whoever uh, has this sensation of freedom uh, at this time, I, I hope you can relate to me. I hope you also feel this new sense of freedom. Anyway, so in this video, I guess I'll just do, do some, some hand movements. I feel like that's usually... I feel like in this kind of environment that it can be pretty nice. Just some manipulating hand movements. I don't know what you would actually call it. Maybe Reiki-like, but it's not, it's not exactly Reiki. You know? I hope everyone has nice weather at the moment. Right now, it's very nice here exactly the right temperature. Overall, it hasn't been very warm in the Netherlands, but it's okay. I figured now would be the best time to record ASMR video since I have this incredible peace of mind at the moment. Just feel intensely calm. So I hope I can kind of transfer that to you.
birds. Pigeons I recognize, other birds I'm not so good at. I know that I look a little bit uh, <laughs> like with the, the hair and the facial hair. I'm going to get a haircut and shave today. But I figured it would be fun to see the contrast between the says Luke and them in my next video. Me <laughs> having recovered. <laughs> this time. I was uh, doing it very intensely at the end, working towards that deadline. I'm not great with deadlines. <laughs> I'm such a perfectionist that I keep adding more instead of polishing, which isn't good. At some point you have to say, it's good enough. And you're just going to finish it. So I think in the last week, I worked like 80 hours on the piece. But it's done now. I never need to do school again. Back. Back. Come. Ducky. My cat is here. He doesn't like being picked up, sadly. <laughs> no. He does not let me pick him up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wanted to show him, but no. Yeah, I feel like, I don't know, you always see this, um, they always say like, oh, the best thing to say in a job interview uh, as your weakness is perfectionism. Like, oh, that's not a real weakness, that's just a good thing. But no, <laughs> perfectionism is not a good thing. Perfectionism does not mean that your end product is better. It just means that you probably will not finish your product. <laughs> so... There's just not going to be a product in the end because you want it to be perfect, but it's never going to be perfect, so you just don't finish it. That's what perfectionism actually does. And for a potential employer, that would be the worst thing ever because, you know, in capitalism, all that matters is good enough, not perfect. So, I don't know, I think it's silly to think that perfectionism is somehow a good thing. So for all the perfectionists out there, I know your struggle, but also know that you can, you can overcome it, you can work on it.
Hmm. What other hand movements are there? Just gonna press. Write me some, uh, write some comments in the comment section about your favorite hand movements. Not necessarily from this video, but I'm curious. Just to maybe learn something. the other way around, pressing it together. All of my sticks. to follow, follow the points of the stick. Insect flew into my stick. Keep following the stick. Keep following. Keep following. Good. Keep following the point of the stick. Good. 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 Keep following. Keep following. All right. Now I'm going to use it to point at something. Look at. I think that's a chair, right? Look at this chair. Okay. Now look at this little light here. You see that? It's not on. It's like a little, little pole with a light. See? Look at that. Alright, now look back at the chair. Look at the point of the stick. Good. Look at the lamp. Look at my nose. Look at the chair again. Now look at the lamp. Look at the point of the stick. And now look at my nose. And now look at the lamp. Very good. Wow. The sun is really starting to shine, isn't it?
pieces there. Alright, I found a tiny little stick. Now I'd like you to tell me whether point A or point B is closer. Okay. Point A. trigger. I always like that one. Um, okay. Let's stop with the stick. I'm just gonna do one last trigger, I think. Let me just get these things out of the way. I kind of want them, I think. Okay. Um, I'm gonna move these are coming back. Tell me which one it is. Very simple. You ready? Good. 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 Perfect. Good. Good. Very good. Good. Very good. Great. Doing really well. Good, that was both again. Good. And last one. Very good. Alright. Um Okay. I'm going to spend some more time with my mom, and I hope that uh, you have an amazing time. I hope you have an amazing time. It's, uh, it's summer. I hope you have an amazing weather and time this summer. I hope you're feeling free. And I hope you enjoyed this video, and that it was relaxing. And I'll see you in the next one. And I hope you see me in the next one. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Oh, cut.